It's all on this USB drive. All the evidence you need to nail Typhon for Gabe's death and plenty more. All right. Bring it with you. I'll meet you in an hour. Thanks. Talk soon. Citizens of Haven Spring, we are live at the Spring Festival. One final reminder to head over to the Lathe Flower Cart and grab a rose before they're gone. At Haven's inaugural Spring Festival, eligible women of good stock and birthing age would offer up roses in order to attract a mate. What can I say? History is weird. Thankfully, we've lost the mating stuff, but kept the roses. And if you do have a special someone in mind, a rose is a great way to say you care, and an even better way to say, hey look, a rose. Sounds fun. Is giving away a rose something I'd do? Maybe. I can decide downstairs. For now, I'll grab the USB stick. Okay, time to head downstairs. Happy first Spring Fest. Thanks. I need to apologize to you guys. What happened in the apartment? Something really messed me up. Hearing Gabe's voice, I wasn't ready for that. I thought I was, but it's the same old story. I lose control and I hurt the people I care about. I'm sorry. 
Yeah. Fuck that. If anyone needs to apologize, it's me. Ever since we've met, you've been there for me. And then when you're the one struggling, I bail. Not cool. I'm really sorry. If we're both sorry, does that just cancel everything out? I think so. We're back to normal. <laughs> Not to spoil the moment, but Typhon blew up their own mine. Why? I don't know yet. But we have all the evidence we need to nail them for Gabe's death. I got a hold of Pike. He'll be here soon. Once he sees what's on that stick, it's over for Typhon. Hence the celebration. <laughs> I think we've all earned the right to enjoy ourselves a little tonight. The band's coming on soon. You'd better be front and center. Oh, Rad. Do you need help setting up for the show? Nah, it's all good. We're almost there. I have to run back to the trailer. Go be a normal person for a while. Can't make any promises. Text me when it's ready. If I wanted to give away a rose, Steph and Ryan would definitely be on my list. Anyway. Time to enjoy the festival. It happened last year. Yep. I remember it clearly. It's been a hell of a month. But this makes it all worthwhile. Jed loves this town so much. It's inspiring. Probably around. Yeah. So then, where's the after party this year? Hi, Eleanor. Good evening, dear. The decorations really turned out beautifully. It must have been a huge amount of work. It's worth it. So, we doing shots tonight or what? Of course. Body shots. Who's going first? Just kidding. <laughs> or am I? <laughs> I better get going. Enjoy your night. You too. God, I just hope Riley is doing all right. Oh no. What happened to Riley? broadcast live from the park. Right? It almost makes you feel like a tiny Coachella. <laughs> Super This tiny. is awesome. So, listen to anything. Favorite like time it. of the So this is that whole communal gathering thing everyone's always going on about. out of the diner, rolled over a couple of tables along the way. I hey, Steph.
Doing this takes a certain type of person, and I am not that person. Two thirty two, two thirty three, two thirty four. This game is no. so demoralizing. The red one was 234. Why do I do this Wait. to myself? Hmm. Maybe Damn it. I can help him somehow. <sighs> one. Hi. Oh, hey. Nice to see you. You're taking this jelly bean thing very seriously. Yeah, because the prize is a $100 gift card. Chrissy's been all anxious ever since she got lost. So. I thought I could get her a bunch of treats. Which is really embarrassing, saying it out loud. Not at all. That's sweet. Maybe I can help. Oh, for real? Are you good at this? How many jelly beans do you think there are? Three hundred... ish. Huh. Yeah, could be. Feels like something just changed in that lady by the jar. Maybe I should read her. Three hundred? What a nitwit. Not even close. I was that far off? Maybe I should say something before he guesses wrong. Also, the hell is your problem, lady? <sighs> this game is so demoralizing. Why do I do this to myself? Hmm. Maybe I can help him somehow. Hey, I've got another guess. Yeah? I think it's closer to 700. Yeah, 700 feels right. But we have to get it exactly. Just felt that lady's heart skip a beat. I should read her again. Hear me, they're really close to 731. Who is this girl? Hell yes, your secret's mine. Hear me, they're really close to 731. Who is this girl? <sighs> this game is so demoralizing. Why do I do this to myself? The answer is 731. Don't ask me how. 731 jelly beans. That's. That's correct. Yes! Thanks so much for your help. You rule. <laughs> no sweat. to kill. Might as well wander around and be social. The world's most unnecessary vodka delivery system. Okay, Ryan is waiting on me. Haven really parties at this festival, huh? I heard the call. And I wanted to thank you. I know you tried to do the right thing. So... What now? I'm taking Typhon down. The whole hornet's nest. I'm not betting against you. But... In the meantime... They're the only ones cutting checks in town. And 
And if I want to keep Riley, I can't be broke. I guess I can't blame you. Money's money. Just keep your guard up, okay? It's always flattering to see how much you care about me. But you know I'm spoken for, right? Ugh. There's the Mac I know. Sounds Take like Ryan it easy, is ready dude. for me. I better head back. Can't wait to see this mystery band tonight. Just in time. So, who's playing? Yours truly. Seriously? That's awesome! Well, wait, who else? Eat you both. We didn't want you to wuss out. <laughs> Who said anything about wussing out? Nobody, but only because we didn't give you the opportunity. This is gonna be awesome, trust me. Um, we've never played together before, and, uh, anyway, sorry if this sucks. Fuck it.
Hey, Charlotte. How deep do you think? The lake, I mean. I don't know. I felt horrible this afternoon. I didn't know if I could survive that feeling. But now... It's like when your leg falls asleep. And even though it's still attached, it's become something other than you. My whole life, I've always felt so deeply. But maybe this is better? Charlotte, I'm so sorry. Sorry for what? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Mm. Me neither. Good to see you, Alex. Have fun at the festival. Sounds like Ryan wants to meet me on the rooftop. Okay, I gotta admit, this is a pretty great feeling. Grand opening tomorrow. Free soup and salad for spring festival attendees. Gotta pull my shit together for this grand opening. Just These people won't be so gracious forever. Yourself. We might. I'll take a coupon. No coupons, my dear. Just tell me your name and I'll remember it. All right. Alex Chen. Alex Chen? Didn't we speak already tonight? Nope. Stupid. So stupid. Print some coupons, they said. It's a small town, I'll remember, I said. Oh, hubris. You know, you could try posting on my block. Whoever comments gets the deal. Oh. Well, that's a good idea. Best of luck. There's still a decent crowd milling around tonight. The LARP was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was. Do you Damn it. think there's food left? I'm head over heels for this dork. Are you hungry? What do I do? I That's a rough place to be. God, I still like her so much. Are you? What do I do? Wait, they're both into each other. Hey, um... It's the Spring Fest. You're both obviously into each other. Just make out already. What? <laughs> you heard me. Is it that obvious? Is what obvious? Fuck. Julia... I don't want to screw this up. What? I don't want to be late for this surprise. Time to head up to the rooftop. I have a surprise for you. Good surprise or bad surprise? I started a farm in Moondrop Ranch. 
Get out! I didn't expect that him playing my favorite game validate. would be a turn on. The nurse but is adorable. Here we are. I'll be real with you right now. Wait, is someone standing out past the bridge of flowers? Pretty late for a bus ride. Looks pretty dead over there. The Spring Fest is pretty cool, but I should probably head up to the rooftop. Just have to wait. That's all. Maybe Riley could use some company right now. Hey, Riley. Oh. Hey. What are you doing here? Just taking a walk. I needed a breather from all that socializing. I get that. I was supposed to leave on the bus tonight. So many hopes and dreams all poured into one fucking bus ride. But it's okay. Nana needs me now. She was there for me before and now it's my turn. And I don't have to do it solo. I have Mac helping me. That's something. Eleanor is so lucky to have you. Thanks, Alex. Hang in there, okay? I will. You're awesome. I don't want to be late for this surprise. Time to head up to the rooftop. There's still a decent crowd milling around tonight.
Tada! It, it, it's a tree. Thank you, wilderness expert. I was more wondering why. My mom used to get insomnia when I was a kid. She'd drive over here to the lantern, three in the morning, to work in the garden. <laughs> Sometimes she'd take me with her. It's always been a special place for me. I hope it can be for you too. I should have been taking better care of it. Come on. You've had other stuff to worry about, like totally killing that set. <laughs> You're such a rock star. Thanks for everything. I had fun. And so did the audience. You know they're going to make you do it again next year, right? You, you good? Yeah, fine. Guess I've just been too wrapped up to think about what the future looks like. <laughs> okay. So let's think about it. Alex's future in Haven Springs. The major motion picture. The ride. On ice. <laughs> <laughs> Close your eyes. It's morning, chilly, you can see your breath. You're walking down Main Street on the way to work. Where? The Lantern. Okay, kind of a safe choice, but I get it. So after work. Sun's still up for another couple hours. It's warm now. You're carrying your jacket under your arm. What's the plan? Sit right here on the roof and play my guitar. Smart. Stay in practice. Only a few more months till the next Spring Fest. Anyway... Someone's at the door. Who? Only the coolest person in Haven Springs. He walks up to you in an extremely cool way. <laughs> His plaid jacket swaying in the breeze. Dork. <laughs> yeah. I'm not trying to get you to plan out your whole life, but if you decide you wanted to put down roots, Haven Springs will always make space for you. Was that a gardening pun? No. Maybe. <laughs> I... I really care about you, Alex. A lot. You're the most amazing person I've ever met. Come on, dummy, kiss her. Kiss her.
rejoin the festivities? I'll get you a funnel cake. Maybe you could save me one. Yeah, of course. I'll see you down there. Alex, do you have the USB drive? I do. It's all here. Gabe's call, their secret plan, the cover-up. You need to come with me to the station. Alex, don't make this hard. Probably isn't how you pictured your first spring festival, huh? Not exactly. Coffee? I'm all right. Thanks, though. Good. Because we're, uh, actually out. Pike, why am I here? The long and short of it is, Diane is charging you with stealing her USB drive. That's bullshit. I haven't done anything wrong. They're the criminals here. Did you steal this USB drive or not? At least tell me you looked at it. I can't. Sorry. What do you mean? Why not? Well, one, I would need a warrant. And two, the case is closed. The order came down today. I did what I could, but, you know, the evidence just wasn't there. Sorry, Alex. The order came down today from who? High up. Boss's boss's boss. It's not my job to know. Look, what happened to my brother wasn't an accident. It was criminal. The files on that drive prove it. That could be true. But let's say it is. The issue is you stole Typhon's property. I can't work with that. I just handed you a smoking gun. It shouldn't matter how I got it. Maybe not. 
but it does. Alex, you're not thinking about this clearly. Seems pretty clear to me. Diane wants to charge you with computer fraud. That's a federal crime, Alex. Five to ten, easy. You're telling me I might go to prison for this? For five to ten years? It's not that bad. Hey, I talked to her, and despite how angry she is at everything you did, she's willing to let it go. If you agree to drop everything, Typhon won't press any charges. Why would she do that? She just wants this whole thing to go away. This is how to make that happen. Fuck that. I'm not signing anything. Alex. No. Typhon buried something in the mountains. Something so massive, they ignored Gabe's call and set off the blast just to cover it up. Don't you want to know what it is? What do you mean, cover it up? Another blast, unannounced, set off at the exact same time at the old mining site. And all of it happened just a few weeks before inspections were set to begin. Come on, Pike. It's all right here. Like I said, it doesn't matter. Alex, please, just sign the form, and we can both go back to the party. No. Alex, this is not an offer that you can choose. I said no. No is not an option. What are you so scared of? See for yourself. Shit. What could be in that envelope? Is this a threat? What did you expect? Huh? The Typhon, a global organization with billions in revenue, an army of lawyers, and who knows how many politicians in their pockets would just what, throw up their hands and say, you got us. I don't know. I was just focused on getting the truth. The truth? is that you have no idea what Typhon is capable of. Shit. Believe me, I want nothing more than to make these fuckers pay. I've learned the hard way that it's not possible. They're too big. Too connected, too ruthless. You can hate me if you want. Call me a coward. But I don't want to lose you like we lost Gabe. Pike is terrified of Typhon. I bet if I took his fear away. But it's not just about me. Steph and Ryan are in danger too. Fuck. I want to hurt Typhon so bad. But can I really put their lives at risk along with mine? to do a sign? Yeah. <clears throat> I 
Next marks the spot. Can't turn back now. Time to sign my soul away. Fuck me. Thank you, Alex. You did the right thing. I can't believe this. I had them. How did it go so wrong? I have no idea what to do next. Maybe talking to Jed will help me feel better. First, I need to get out of this dress. I'll treasure it too, Ryan. Enjoy that ice cream. Might as well go talk to Jed now. Hey, Jed. There she is. Have a seat. Something tells me you've had a more exciting spring festival than you planned for. You saw Pike arrest me. And let you go, apparently. Then there's that business with Ryan and Steph earlier today. I wasn't sure why it took all three of you to work out Diane's lunch order. I know you're used to looking out for yourself. Gabe was like that. But Haven's a community. We help each other. I want to help you. But first, you have to let me know what's going on. Fuck it. What have I got to lose?
Typhon killed Gabe. I have proof. What proof? I stole it from Diane. Emails and documents proving there was a second explosion the night Gabe died. To cover something up, Jed. Some secret they buried. I don't know what it is. I don't even know what to do next. But I'm not giving up. Not ever. I know what they're hiding. Please, Jed. What's the truth? What are they afraid of? Typhon's the devil that runs this town. I've been carrying their secrets for far too long. I know what they buried in the mountains. Tell me. I'll do one better. I'll show you. There, up ahead. Where are we? The middle of nowhere. About two clicks that way is the mining site where you search for Ethan. Five clicks that way is town. What is this thing? Ventilation shaft. They're scattered everywhere. Over the years, mines grow into mines, creating a labyrinth under Haven. What you're searching for is down below. Chad, why are you sad? Sorry, kid. Okay. Just put the gun down. I tried to talk you out of it. Scare you off? I was sure those pictures of Ryan and Steph would do the trick. But you were relentless. Won't leave damn well enough alone. You don't have to do this. I do. Twelve years ago, I made a mistake. The kind of thing that you, you can't undo. But Typhon made me a deal. A way to save my town. Give my boy a normal life. I never wanted Gabe to get hurt. Hell. Welcome back, Alex. Do you want to talk about your time in Colorado? Let's start with something positive. What did you learn from your visit to Haven Springs? I 
thought I learned what it means to make a place your home. That must have felt like quite the victory. Let's talk about how it feels to know that you might have been wrong. I suppose I'm proud of you for trying. You helped some people. Chased a mystery. Got to kiss a sweet boy. But Alex, you're right back where you started. I know. Oh, you don't know anything, Alex. You don't even know you're not really here. What the fuck? I guess that's me. Case number 53322. Thrown down a... what? Twelve years ago, I made a mistake. Kind of thing that you you can't undo. Alex, you know that I care about you. With everything that has happened, I just want what's best for you. These don't belong to Dr. Lin. A tuning peg.